Welcome to the WCPO Insider Report. A tri-state karate studio will be honored in Indianapolis later this month. Seven Star Dragons Karate is run by Terrell Davis. Davis is a former Kentucky parole officer who says that she wanted to get involved before people got into the system. She's been teaching karate for several years. She adds that karate helps kids become more confident and it helps them stay focused with their studies. It takes a lot of time, but it's just I'm contributing to society and I'm hoping that I'm making a difference. So it's all worth it, every investment and in the young people and even adults alike. So I, I really think it's a fun time. Right now we're joined by WCPO.com insider Lucy May. You got to see Davis and her karate kids literally in action. What made her go from parole officer to basically karate instructor? Yeah, she's a karate master. She is a many degrees that, black yeah. belt. Okay, so um, multiple levels. Yeah, yeah. Right. She's she actually she said she studied karate in college when she was learning to be a parole officer. I believe she went to Eastern Kentucky University. She really got serious about it after she got her job and realized that she might need to protect herself from time to time in the line of work that she was in. And after working in that industry for a few years, back in the mid 80s, she decided, you know what, I could really help some of these young people before they get involved in the criminal justice system by teaching them discipline and the kind of respect that they need to, to practice karate and be good at it and the focus and just giving them something productive to do. So she started teaching all those years ago. She got really serious about it when she retired from her career um, as a parole officer in 1999 and she's been teaching ever since. Well, looking at the video here, you can tell she's seen firsthand the impact that this martial art has had on kids. Yeah, she really is. I had the pleasure not only of watching some of her very young students, but also talking to some gentlemen who um, started learning f from her when they were young little boys. One one guy started when he was four and he was little for his age mm -hmm. and his mom decided that karate would help him make him more confident. He's now um, 29. He's, oh, a, right? he's a lawyer. He said karate. He thinks the discipline, he, he's a black belt and he thinks that really that discipline helped him through law school and made him the successful person he is today. Success stories, a story yeah. that you can read right now on our website at WCPO.com.